Competition is my favorite. Twelve-year-old Abigail Stewart looks like an average kid holding a charity bake sale, but this sale isn't for a local church or school group. She's raising funds for the Children's Hospital Oncology Unit, the unit that saved her life. I was diagnosed with multi-system LCH. It's where my white blood cells mutate and attack the body, leaving tumors all over. Abby was first diagnosed when she was just four and a half years old and went through a year of treatment involving chemotherapy and steroids. The cancer-like illness is now in remission, but she still visits the hospital regularly. I know what it's like to be sick in the hospital. It's not fun. So I'm trying to give back to some kids. When you're faced with a child that is sick, it is the most devastating news you can ever have. Without the hospital, we probably wouldn't have Abby today. Abby's mom says she's so proud of her daughter's drive to help others. Today's bake sale was entirely Abby's idea. Abby is the most fun-loving, easygoing kid, and she just loves giving back. Like She thinks of ways to raise money for the hospital and to help kids. Kids like Abby who have been through such traumatic experiences, um, a, a really good thing for actually therapy is to either organize an event or share your story or um, just talk about what you've been through to people because it, when you internalize it as you get older it's more difficult so the fact that Abby and her family and, um, and I know their friends Tracy have worked so hard to come together to do this bake sale is phenomenal. The sale also included donations of gift baskets for raffle prizes, hot dogs, drinks and even a special appearance from the Winnipeg Blue Bombers own Buzz and Boomer. I am thankful to all the people that came and helped. Very, very thankful. Thank you, Abby. Now, Abby's hoping to raise $5,000 for the Children's Hospital Oncology Unit. Best thing about a bake sale for a good cause? No calories. In Winnipeg, Erica Natividad, City News.